I'm Kristen Rohde Ricci. I am owner and uh, cosmetologist here at Savvy Salon and Spa. This is my mother, Beth Rohde. Hello. Uh, Kristen and I own the salon together, and we've been working together at the salon for about four and a half years. We purchased it in July of 2011 and we just increased our services and increased the number of people that work here throughout the four and a half years that we've been in business. I started out uh, 13 years ago as a cosmetologist. I managed two salons uh, in Sioux City, Iowa before uh, having this opportunity to buy a Savvy Salon and Spa uh, almost uh, five years ago. So we started with uh, only myself and my mother and two massage therapists and we've now increased to uh, four stylist stations. We previously only had two and um, now we have five cosmetologists, one esthetician and one massage therapist. Uh, well, I got really involved with the chamber about uh, two years ago. I've been part of the Chamberettes, which is Women of the Chamber, for the past four years. Uh, getting more involved uh, with them really for the past two years. Uh, last year we did uh, Cardinal Days. We had a booth at Cardinal Days where we did color strands, uh, jewelry tattoos, bling strands for little kids. Our massage therapist, uh, Eric Thomas, he did uh, chair massages for people. Um, we've done lots of events uh, with the Chamberettes. Uh, we do a benefit, a luncheon uh, through them. I've done uh, the program for their meeting on beauty tips, tricks, and myths and had some fun with the ladies. I, we do a couple times a year, we do a women's day for the women and children from the mission at the shelter down there. And we have them come in and we do haircuts and styles and some makeup and nails and just make them feel great about themselves. And I just love uh, giving back. I feel uh, like that is something that I need to do to give my my time. Uh, we were involved in the Chamber Golf Tournament this year. We gave gift certificates as prizes that they handed out. Um, we enjoyed being part of that golf tournament. Another thing that we were involved in this year is the annual Chamber Banquet. Uh, several of us attended that. We also donated a cake for the cake auction. Uh, part of the things we enjoy doing with the Chamber are also the after hours and the lunch to learn. We've also hosted one of the coffees and we have another one scheduled for this spring. Well, we've grown a lot in the past four and a half years. As I said, we went from uh, two owners uh, and two massage therapists to now we've grown to uh, eight employees total. We were a uh, salon and spa the entire time, but we have grown in our spa services. Uh, we now um, offer so much more than hair and nail services, uh, full-time massage. Uh, therapy. We have an esthetician who does eyelash extensions. We also do body wraps and have a new cosmetologist and tattoo artist who does permanent makeup. We are very honored to accept this award of small business of the year. My staff, my mother and I have uh, worked very hard and the hard work has paid off and I am so proud of my Savvy Salon team and look forward to what we accomplish in the future. During the month of October last year, we held a month-long fundraiser to uh, go to Susan G. Komen for the cure of breast cancer. We took a dollar of every product sold and a dollar of every service that we did and we raised $275 and presented that to Susan G. Komen.